Hey there, ladies and gentlemen, KJ Andio in the house. Welcome to the food experience. Today's experience is going to be done at Chili's Restaurant. That's what I'm going for. So let's go inside. All right, here we go into Chili's. I want to thank you all for tuning into this experience. Hopefully this will be a good one. I like Chili's. They have some good menu items. Let's check it out, folks. They also have some good deals. And it was like a three for 10 or something like that. We're at a mall, there's a circus going on. Circus Vargas is in town. Chili's baby back ribs. Barbecue sauce. Hey everybody, in Chili's right now, decided to order one of the two for 25s. I have a friend with me who's not gonna be on camera. Anyhow, I got a Coca-Cola and a drink. For our appetizer, we went with the onion petals. Here they are right here. They give you this like tangy sauce. They give you two different ones. I'm guessing one is probably like a ranch and the other is, I'm not sure. <laughs> but they smell really good. They smell like onion rings that are shaped into petals. Like if you ever had a blooming onion in Outback, imagine taking that thing apart and putting them in a little container. And this is pretty much what I guess you would get. So let me dig in. Try one of these. First I'll try this uh, kind of orange colored sauce. Oh yeah, it's got a nice kick to it. Some kind of peppers in there. It may be um, ranch based. The onion pellet, nice and crunchy on the outside, tender on the inside. Let me try the red white one. Ranch, definitely ranch. The other one. It's some kind of spicy concoction. It's really tasty. That's my take on the onion pills. For my um, entree, I chose the, um, I think it's a bacon quesadilla. And for dessert, it's going to be a chocolate cookie skillet thing. So stay tuned for that. So here I am trying the orange sauce again. I'm starting to get a handle on it now. It is tangy. It's almost a little bit sweet for a second, but it turns tangy. And the zippiness is definitely horseradish. I'm not a big fan of horseradish usually, but I like this version of it. Like regular horseradish, forget it. Cannot even do it. But this way, I could definitely scoop this up. Delicious for me. I like horseradish, I guess, but I come from the Jewish persuasion. Our tribe um, likes a lot of horseradish, so <laughs> even though it's not really for me normally, our people like it. Our people. <laughs> Anyhow. Um, Quesadillas? Oh. Just in time. I'm doing a food review. <laughs> This will be for the fajitas. Bacon right quesadillas. Back. Check that out, folks. And it also comes with its own sauce. Oh, I didn't mean to spill that. Lucky it spilled on my utensil holder. Okay, so I don't normally do tomatoes. These definitely have a fair share of tomatoes on them. So I'm going to brush them aside. Because I am a very picky eater. You may not know that about me, but I am. I don't mind a couple tomatoes here and there. It's not a make it or break it thing, but I don't like a lot of tomatoes. Um, I also like to know they put a nice dollop of sour cream on there. Cheers, everybody. Right, right. Oh, here come fajitas. I hear it. Is there anything else that we're going to be I think we're good, man. You're excellent. Thank you. 
We got some fajitas going on here. Nice looking fajitas. Doing wonderful. <laughs> You're awesome. Thank you. The sizzling fajitas look really good. They serve them with a black beans. And then they give you this little bar right here, which has tomatoes, looks like salsa, sour cream, cheddar cheese, guacamole, and tortillas. So I gotta figure out what kind of sauce this is that came with my bacon cheddar quesadilla things. Taste test. Sound familiar? That's interesting. That's almost like a bacon ranch type of sauce. That's really good. Let's grab one of these. Here's one of the cheddar bacon quesadilla bits with chicken. Looks really good. Oops. Smells good. Definitely a good ratio of chicken, bacon, cheddar. Tortilla is nice and fresh. Not hard, definitely nice and soft. Definitely well recommend this. Get some sour cream in the mix. I like the white meat chicken. I'm a white meat chicken person. Don't really like dark meat. This does me great. The bacon ranch dressing that they give you on the side adds a whole nother dimension to it. It's really good. Regarding the fajitas, I was given a, looks like a flour tortilla. Put a piece of chicken with some rice and bell pepper and onion in there. Looks pretty good. And um, there's condiments to go with it. Gonna take some cheese mix, put it on there. Definitely looks like real fresh made guacamole. And the salsa, smells pretty good. And a little dab of sour cream. So here's my little concoction that I made. Looks really good. There were also um, either black beans or kidney beans. I don't know what kind they are, but not really the type of beans that I enjoy. I'm a pinto bean guy. Here's what the beans look like. I'm just not into those type of beans, but I am into this. Not spicy. I could use a little heat, to be honest. The white meat chicken, really good. The bell pepper, onion, sour cream, guacamole, I mean, all of that just adds to the experience. It's really good. Yeah, so we really dig in this little chicken rice, green pepper, onion concoction that I made with the fajitas. This is definitely really good. I mean, considering got all this food for $25, with an appetizer of the onion petals. With the dessert that you haven't quite seen yet. I already had it once before a few months ago. It was really good. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat. I'll join you back for dessert. Back to the chicken, bacon, cheddar, quesadilla thing. Uh, let's dissect this for a sec, right? Check that out. Lots of cheddar cheese, lots of chicken. You see bacon bits in there. The ratio is really good, especially with that sour cream. Yow. Thumbs up on everything so far. I found it. You found it. There See, you I go. knew it came with ice cream on it. <laughs> wow. Yeah. So check this out, folks. An ice cream fudge chocolate cookie full of deliciousness. Yeah. Thank you. All right. So I got a scoop with ice cream fudge cookie.
tell you what, this is an awesome dessert here. Vanilla ice cream. It's got like some kind of fudge on it. I don't know if it's hot fudge. Let me see. No, it's like a cold fudge. The cookie though. The cookie is so warm and hot. All the chocolate chips are melted. Goodness. Totally soft, melted chocolate in there. The ice cream kind of cools it all down. What an awesome dessert. So thank you so much, you guys, for tuning into my experience at Chili's. We are here at the Palmdale location. Thanks for tuning in. Join me on another experience real soon. I'm KJ Andy, your host with the most. Take care, my fine folks, and I'll see you next time. Peace.